Good morning, guys. Welcome on back into TK's Garage. And, um, man, major shout out to y'all, man. Major thanks and shout out to you guys for um, getting started early on the giveaway, man. Y'all guys have been pushing my people's channels so hard right now, man. Y'all got ZTRD over 800. Y'all push Beauty 392B. She, she about to be at, at, at 2.3 um, thousand subs, man. Major salute to y'all. Um, we saw AA underscore Rose booming. She getting them subs. Dream Chasing Geo getting them subs. Hellcat Migo getting them subs. Man, New York in your city. Everybody, y'all, you guys have just been amazing. We haven't even got started yet. Can y'all imagine? And I, I didn't even get a chance to go check out Lucky and Melly yet this morning. So, major shout out to all of you guys. Just off the strength of just that mention yesterday, you guys are doing it friggin' big. So, today's video is a little different. We are on the way. A couple things. I have a party or a thing I have to go to for work. But it's kind of like an adult party. I don't know how to explain it. Uh, needless to say, we're on the way to Victoria's Secrets today. And maybe some other things. So we'll, we'll, we'll see how that goes. I know y'all going to be like, oh, oh, shit. And yes, the porn goatee is back, okay? I know I kind of got rid of it because I was on my Emmett Smith and I wanted to do the Just For Men. But uh, nah, nah. We're going to put the softening joint in it so it's not all scraggly and sticking and all that good shit. But yeah, it's back. It's staying. The goatee is here to stay. Um, but today, we are taking the Black Mamba and she's getting cho cho chopped up. She's not getting chopped up. She's getting dropped off to my dude Travis over at Firestone. And the truck is getting another inch and some change in height and a much bigger tire on the Black Mamba with some Firestone joints going on this bad boy today. So, let's get into it. So, shout out to my dude Travis and shout out to, to Firestone. Um... We're on the way out there now, and that's out here in Fayetteville by uh, Cross Creek Mall. Now, here's the thing. I do a lot of my own work on my vehicles, and that includes oil changes, uh, especially with the uh, Royal Purple and whatever that I like to run in my vehicles. But, um, you know, like time management, when you're doing YouTube or anything else, time management is so important. You have to, you have to, have to delegate when you can, you know what I'm saying? You have to have time management because if you don't, you're going to be running yourself ragged, never get a break, never get a chance to do anything different. This quack, quack. sucker in front of me today, man. Um, you never get to do anything different, you know what I'm saying? So I'm delegating and I have before, like I just, you know, I, you know, like an oil change could take me like 45 minutes to an hour. Why do that when I could spend that hour getting content, going to buy some shit, um, you know, go to Copart, go do something in that hour. And that's what I've learned to do. So, and, and major shout out to Travis, because here's the thing though, and not, and this is not, not a snub against Firestone because someone's going to be like, oh, that's kind of cold. Look, man, not every Firestone is, is, is good. All right. Like it all is, it, it all depends on the people that work there. All right. I can tell you hundred percent like keeping it 100 a buck that if like Travis is gone or he goes to XYZ company my vehicles is going to XYZ company you know what I'm saying <laughs> I'll be calling Firestone and be like y'all can cancel that credit card I'm going over it you know what I'm saying <laughs> and that's it end of story because it is uh, in the car business or anything that deals with cars it is about relationships right and, and it's about people that you trust and people doing your doing I would say doing your shit but doing your cars the right way that's the the most important thing you know what I'm saying so but uh we're running and yeah for anybody that lives out here in Fayetteville you already know how these dumbasses be running down 401 man they be you gotta pass in the right lane tell me what kind of what, what kind of sense does that make? Passing in the right lane. Yo, RIP to anybody in the stock market right now. Um, I'll talk about that for a minute. 
Robin Hood, link in the description, guys. Get a free stock. It's free, but don't put your money in right now. <laughs> Wait, because I think we're going to take a little bit more of a beating in the market. It's going to go down another 2 3 4%. Uh, I'm talking about everybody NASDAQ S&P Dow Jones everybody's taking a beating and I think it's gonna happen a couple more for a couple more days so uh, Like today is Saturday the markets is closed But I think like Monday and Tuesday are gonna suck of this coming week and I think I'm gonna publish this on the same day We're shooting it today. So um, I Think it's gonna suck. I really do. I think it's gonna be like uh, shit that sucks. You know what I'm saying? so we'll have to see but um I'm driving at quack, quack. fuckers, man. But uh, if you're investing in the stock market, because I know a lot of people that are subscribers here that are friends of the channel, you guys, some, you guys are doing Robinhood, and some of you guys have invested and made some good money. I guess the biggest thing I can tell you is <clears throat> when the market goes up, like when these stocks take a, a beating here in the next couple days, and I buy in even more, like I put more money in. You have to know that when the market goes back up, you have to be ready and know when to take some profits. You got to take them profits because if you don't, um, you're going to hold the L. You got to take them damn profits. So when you can take the profits, take them. Stock suck them in. I, I, I mean, I'm sorry. I, I, I don't have patience for people that don't drive the damn speed limit and you out here in the left lane. What are you doing? I wish they had a service. Like some states, you can take a license plate and key it in and find out where somebody's staying. I would, you know, you guys know I I got that ability to just mail somebody a bag of dicks. Like I would literally just like to mail people a bag of dicks and be like, right lane, stay in the right lane if you want to just cruise. So, anywho's. Oh. Well, let's go ahead and put this in a time lapse mode. Let's get up here to Firestone and get the truck into the shop. Listen, guys, the traffic out here, like if you're just seeing that time lapse, people are really that dumb out here. And I don't know what it is. Maybe it's just a Fayetteville thing. I don't understand the people that want to go slower than the speed limit in the left lane. So then people look at me like I'm an asshole when I cut you off. I cut you off and then I'm on my brakes. You know what I'm saying? I, I just, man. And then they, then they like, oh, why? And then they, they move over, you know, then, then they cut the lane over and then they, they want to speed up to get to, towards you to look at you be like, why you cut me? Because you out here being a dumbass, man. Move <laughs> over. <laughs> I don't get it, man. Wow, bro. Really? I almost rear-ended this damn Honda Accord because he stalled. I get it, man. But damn, bro. You got to... Oof, let me, maybe he got a stick and he don't know how to drive it. Oh, come on, man. See, this is the dumb shit that I'm talking about right here. Motherfuckers that don't know how to drive. Like, you see people are out here trying to move and then you want to cut over when you, and here's the thing. It's not like you just see me move. You hear this bitch move. You know what I'm saying? Like, you can hear the mama from a block. If I'm getting on the gas, believe me, they hear this truck. So yeah, that's just a little aggravating. Just just a little bit. Just a little aggravating. But anywho. Man, my truck kind of smells like a gym a little bit. I gotta I might have to Febreze. This is the other reason I don't like cloth seats, man. 
That's why I put the seat cover on the on the you know the Chevy seat cover on mine too. Cause like if you're getting you're going to Copart and I'm sweating my ass off and doing my thing. Oh shit. That's a red light camera too. Damn. Well, and it looks like rain. More friggin' rain. Ugh, rain. Not a good thing, man. Damn it. Well. Well. Interesting. Well. Mm, eat me one of these mints. I chew on these and Tic Tacs like all day. Oh, did you hear that little Miata? That little Miata said, me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that Miata said, tell them how you really feel. <laughs> Say it with me, guys. That shit is hard tuned, huh? I'm an asshole, I know. All right, let's go ahead and get to the damn Firestone. All right, guys, so we made it. We're here up here at the Firestone. And look, Travis still got that beast for sale, man. In case y'all didn't know, I'll have to drop his Instagram in again. And I know y'all, look, shout out to the, shout out to the Thirsty Squad. Because just like ladies, I know some of y'all be saying the fellas be thirsty. Is there a handicap spot open up front? There is. Let me get that spot. I know while some of y'all be saying that the fellas be thirsty, it ain't just the fellas, ladies. Um, some of the, uh, you know, some of the ladies, man, be, you know, thirsty. Ain't nothing wrong with that. You can be thirsty. I've been getting, I got a lot of comments. Yo, is Travis single? Da, 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 da. Look, man. I ain't, I, ain't, I ain't out here telling people's business. Y'all can hit that man up on his own, ladies. <laughs> Y'all be like, TK, TK starting shit all the time, man. All right, guys. So this is the Black Mamba now, okay? Take a good look at it. Those are the Goodyear Duratracks. You can see where the ride height was or where we were at in the wheel wells on this one, all right? Now, these new tires should get us to about right here, all right? Or fill in the wheel well so also getting that little bit of extra height on the tire we should get a little bit more height on the truck so take a good look at where she is now and maybe I'll edit in a comparison with the truck here with the new tires but let's go ahead and go in and give Travis these keys Woo! damn it that's the other thing about losing weight your jeans man your jeans, they don't stay up. They don't stay up at all. What's up, boss? How you doing? Oh. Can you get you on this side of the jeans? All right. Keep more on the uh, side of the thing. Oh, this is him right there? Yeah. <laughs> All right, those right there definitely look good. Hell yeah! So what we're gonna do is we're gonna we're gonna test fit one of them. Yeah. So as soon as we get it in, we're gonna put one of them on there. We're gonna test fit it, make sure everything looks good. Yeah. <sighs> All right. So you guys. You guys got to see it. So shout out to my dude uh, Travis for for looking out, for looking out. Uh, you know, that's what it is, man. You know, friends and family. You know, people people look out for each other. You know, and that's that's just how that works, man. I appreciate it. Now they said I might end up rubbing a little bit here. We'll have to see if that's the case. Um, but the other tire is a lot, is, is a five. So it's a little taller. So you can see 
the, he said the only problem or concern is right here in this area so with the new tires I'm probably gonna be sitting let's see if I get this to line up right I'm probably gonna be sitting about right here so at a hard turn I could end up rubbing on that but um, I don't think so I think we'll be alright and even if so it's not like I'm making super hard turns or whatever and if it rubs it rubs man but uh I think it's going to be alright. I think they're going to fit and I think it's going to look good and we're going to be straight. They're going to test fit one and see how it works. But anyways, let's let them get their work and when we come back, the truck will be ready to go. And guys, again, this beautiful GMC is still available for sale, man. You guys can pick this thing up for the super, super low, alright? This thing is available for 23 k This thing is completely built. This thing is an absolute monster man an absolute monster i'm telling you now these are the same tires now these are 20 what are these 20 what does he got on these 20 these are 22s all right but this is the same tire that's going on the truck so it's a wider tire as you can see it's a wider tire and it's that real mud pattern and they actually sound good on the highway i've actually seen how he's run it with these so uh yeah let's see how it goes anyways like i said this truck is for sale 66 duramax 23k Rub. Oh, did it rub on here too? Oh, yeah. Yeah. You can see where it gripped it right there and started rubbing the whole way over. Yeah. And um, I've cut it before at the 4x4 shop. It's just on this one, I, we can't cut it because of your truck. So there, I could have done it, but yeah. uh, here we just don't do that. All right. So it's just going to be safer for you to do it just. Uh, just Drop down Get the other side. side. Yeah, yeah. So I went ahead and ordered them. They'll be here on Monday. Oh, that's cool. Sound good? Yeah. They look good on there, though. Yeah, these things, it looks clean. Oh, yeah. So what, on this size tire, too, when it's, if it was higher, it's going to put the truck up another inch or so, too, right? Yep. So it's definitely going to look sharp. All right. But, um, what about four places they actually do cut? So, guys, you saw what it was, man. Um, as much as I like the way that those look, in order to make those tires fit appropriately, like they'd have to cut away or start cutting into the um, fender wells and whatnot. And um, I like I like that uh, my dude Travis makes sure that it's done right. You know what I'm saying? And if you're asking why I got this on, it's because we're in here. You have to wear it. It's mandatory. Um, I like that it, that it gets done correctly. It gets done right. And being that, you know, the tires are rubbing or whatever, or it's going to rub really bad, then we'll just go with... Uh, the other side so right now we were at 295 70 18 and we're going to go to 285 65 18 which is still going to be a little bit of a bigger tire and we'll see how they look um when they come in all right guys so you see it we still got the dura tracks on here uh unfortunately they were able to get them mounted on the front and you see that i still got the stuff on the rims the, the tire grease but the issue was they were rubbing on the rear so they it didn't completely fit so sadly somebody must have been short that was driving the truck sadly we have no choice but to um come back monday i hear you mm. we're gonna come back on monday uh oh we're gonna come back on Monday and we're gonna put the uh, 285 65s on deck and that should make a huge difference um, as far as the fit 
Now, they said, you know, they were saying, like, look, you know, you could cut out the rear, da da da. But I really, see, this is why I like Travis, right? Another shot would have been like, yo, if we just cut this out right here, it'll fit. You know what I'm saying? But Travis was like, nah, we're going to do it right. We want them to fit right. And I'm still going to get that really meaty, off road mud tire look. And it's just going to fit right. And it's going to be bigger than what I got now. So it's still going to fill up the wheel wells. So that's all I wanted to do. And um, cause I, you know, people were saying, I, I looked at the American force rims and some of the other ones and I just wasn't feeling it, man. I just didn't want to make the change, you know? So anyways, um, that's what it is. You know, we got to wait till Monday. We got to wait till Monday and that's what it is. He'll call me. We'll put it back in the shop. They'll get the, uh, they'll get it straight. We'll put those 285, uh, 65, 18s on here. And they're a uh, Firestone destination. They're like mud tires. That's what's going in. That's what's going into them, uh, or going on the truck. So we'll see how it goes. But uh, yeah, I mean that's pretty much it. Um, so now we're just gonna head back out to the farm. Oh shit! I just ran the light because I wasn't paying attention. Damn. Oops. Do 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 do. <laughs> try to let's try to uh safely get through this uh Fayetteville madness that they call traffic and oh come on dude really bitch let me just get over here and get real close to your ass now <laughs> bitch ass move sorry anyways um so there's that <laughs> yo I, I be road raging <laughs> yo oh uh, well I don't know guys maybe that's it we're gonna head back out to the farm. Let's go to the time go to time lapse to see if we see anything else on the way out. But this was kind of just an update video of what was going on with the truck today. Um, I went out to you know I went to Lids. As you saw, I got the new Patriots hat on deck. I got my Cam Newton jersey on deck. You know, ready for the season. And it's the home one. It's not the one I would go out to the game. This is just the the little cheap joint when I want to go to the bar and I'm drinking and I want to be an ass. You know, I got. I got the I got the t-shirt on deck to accommodate uh, with my assholeness. You know what I'm saying? Well, I'll show you guys that. Or you guys might have seen it on Instagram. I'll post a picture of both on Instagram. But anyways, let's go to the time lapse and we'll see if we don't see anything else cool, we'll come back, we'll wrap up the video. So it looks like that's going to wrap it up for today's video. I just wanted to, you know, hit the time lapse in the event that I saw something on the way back. And um, outside of traffic, I ain't seeing much. So, uh, man, that classic Caddy, man. I might have to go check that out tomorrow. I see it's for sale. It's got a lot of surface rust on it. But the body, the bones might be good. So we'll have to go check that out. Man, the traffic is no punk today. Wow. But anywho's. I just wanted to post a quick update video, let you guys know what we had going on today. And it was mostly uh, to try to get the new shoes put on put on to the Black Mamba. Um, there's a couple other things that you guys are going to see here in the near future. The other grill and stuff that we just put in for paint uh, is done. So that will be going on the Black Mamba soon. So it should be completely murdered out. Um, if you didn't pay attention to yesterday's video... We are going to be dropping a giveaway. Right now it's scheduled. We're dropping that video on Wednesday. And that's got some channels like Beauty392B, um, T Rose, AA Rose, Hellcat Migo, Dream Chasing Geo, um, JTRD, New York in Your City, Lucky's Wheels and Deals, Melly's World. Yo, if the damn gimbal would just be straight. Lucky's Wheels and Deals, Melly's World. And um, there will be some other channels involved as well Wednesday the full list will drop it's crazy you know there's a navigator on 22s there's a luxury uh, sedan I, I got to do a video on that car so you guys can see what it is uh, as part of the giveaway y'all gonna be hype and uh, $2,500 in cash I mean you really 
you really can't beat it um because we're not making you buy a t-shirt we're not making you um we're not making you smash your neighbor damn yo if the, this is the thing with the with the mobile gimbal right because you know the truck is going up and down hills and shit it never stays focused on like my face if i'm talking it drives me a little nuts but um i look we're not making you do anything crazy you know what i'm saying you ain't gotta like you know do something do something disrespectful or you know whatever you know you're not you're not um i just leave it like that it's real easy you're subscribing to a channel you're hitting the thumbs up button and you're commenting on each video on each channel for the giveaway that's it it's that simple man and it's free it's free um, this is the sad part though. I, I had a comment today and I want to address this now. I had a comment today on it and I had to get them the fuck out of here. I'm going to say it now. And someone's going to be like, TK, we don't like that you're swearing. And I understand that, but that deserved an F-bomb. And let me tell you why. The comment said, and if I got, I, I might even like superimpose it here on the video. The comment said, is there any reason why all of the videos that you want us to subscribe to and hit the thumbs up are all black? Hmm. Well, first of all, everybody that's involved in the giveaway isn't black. Um, not that that matters. But the fact that the, whether you comment or not or whether you subscribe to these channels, you're doing it on the base of somebody's race, color, religion whatever that's that's some bullshit eat a dick eat a dick eat a dick that's some bullshit and if you know me especially where if you know you've seen my wife you know and you've seen for people that followed me for a long time you've seen my my girlfriends and shit over the years i don't have no patience for that shit so immediately you know i had to tell them i had to get them the fuck up out of here I told him to go eat a bag of dicks, and I did tell him that I fucked his mom sideways with a Z. Uh, by the way, if you guys want to see I fucked your mom sideways or sideways t-shirts with the hashtag sideways on it, let me know, and I'll get some sideways t-shirts made. Shout out to my dude, because I know if Calico sees this later, he's going to be like, TK, I need some royalties. Shout out to my dude, Calico the Truth, the way that exactly how it sounds, Calico DA Truth on Instagram. I believe he's still doing YouTube too. He has a couple of YouTube videos too, uh, out in Atlanta, Georgia. He 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 dropped that whole sideways phenomenon back in the day where he was telling trolls, "I fuck your mom sideways." So if if you like the fact that um, where I <laughs> fucking trolls moms sideways, 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 um, hit that thumbs up button. I'm going up the hill. Can you tell the gimbal's like? Rrr, rrr. Um, Hit that, hit that thumbs up button, and if you, you know, feel generous, go give Calico a follow over on Instagram, at Calico the Truth, all right? So, um, and Calico, if we make these sideways t-shirts, I got you, bro. You know how I get down. I, I, I got to give you the royalty. That's, that's your saying. We got to, I got to, I got to hook you up on that. But, uh, if you guys want to see some sideways, uh, t-shirts, let me know in the comment section down below, because we can make that happen. We can, we can definitely make that happen. But uh, with that said, that's going to do it for today's video. Um, hopefully nobody else is going to make any dumbass racist comments in the chat because unfortunately, if I don't get you, one of the mods is going to get you and somebody might fuck your mom sideways. Maybe I need to get Tyrone, maybe I need to hit up my dude Nathil HD on Instagram and have him come through and instead of <coughs> fucking somebody's wives, maybe he needs to fuck <coughs> some of y'all's trolls' moms. I'm done. Oh, and the camera's dropped. The gimbal's driving me nuts. Anyways, with that said, I'm going to lean back and roll, roll this beautiful black mamba all the way back to the farm and call it a day. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you want to get an early start on the giveaway that's dropping Wednesday and subscribe to a bunch of really cool channels, go check out yesterday's video and um, subscribe to all the channels in the list. I'll probably copy it and paste it here too in the description just because. And um, yeah, I mean, you can't beat it. What other, what, other, what other channel on YouTube is doing this kind of shit? Nobody, man. Nobody's doing this, man. A Navigator on 22s for free? A Benz? 2,500 in cash? Man, 
we consistently have given away a vehicle like every single month. That's really how, and if I looked at the time, someone would say, TK, it's actually like every 40 days. All right, every 40 days or 45 days, we're giving away another car. I don't know any other automotive YouTube channels that do that without making you buy a, a t-shirt or, you know, you know, smash your neighbor or do some other weird shit. You know, we're not doing any of that. So anyways, I appreciate all the support from you guys. I appreciate all the love. If you liked today's video, it was completely shot and edited on the Pixel 4a, the food stamp phone of the year. And if you don't know what a food stamp phone is, you should go check out my tech channel, More With TK. But, um, yeah, that's it. I got things to do this evening, literally. <laughs> I hope you guys uh, enjoyed the video. If you did, do me a big favor. Give it a big thumbs up. If you really enjoyed the video, look, man, 80% of you guys that are watching these videos, it's like 79% are not subscribed like hit the subscribe button you're going to continue to see funny content car content you know shit that's just cool and giveaways every single month so um and then every single day like today because uh yesterday we gave away a hundred dollar amazon gift card and um you know i went shopping today so i'm not giving away a hundred dollar amazon gift card today but we will still drop an amazon gift card uh, in the comments below and what I'll do is same thing as usual uh, tonight it, it, it I'll actually will we'll pin the comment at some point this evening because it's still early I think I can get this video up in time where it's like late afternoon so we can pick a comment this evening so Amazon gift card in the comment section down below um, on top of everything else that we're already doing you know we try to give back on every single video here on the channel if I got the opportunity to do it I'm giving it back to you guys got another sponsor by the way before we get out of here that hit me up today and they want to do they were like look we have a four thousand dollar budget do you want to give it away all at one time or do you want to break it up over like 10 videos like basically do a four hundred dollar giveaway on 10 videos i'll let you guys decide you guys can vote on that in the comments below you could be like hashtag four thousand or hashtag 10 videos and let me know and uh, we'll go from that. But damn, we got a lot of stuff going in the comments today. There's going to be a lot of comments. Somebody's going to win this Amazon gift card today. All right. With that said, guys, thank you very much for watching. Major shout out to my dude, Travis, over there at Firestone for always, always looking out for your boy. And I will catch you guys on the next one. Sideways, sideways, sideways. <laughs>